Thank you very much, guys. I'm here with Perks after G2 Esports beats RNG for a spot in the semifinal. What just happened? I don't know. <laughs> I, have no, I have no idea what to say. I, it's definitely unexpected, right? Yeah. How are you so calm? I, I just didn't care. I, I just don't. I just don't care. For the last couple of weeks, I just don't care. I, I'm so I'm so like mentally drained out that I just don't care and I just play. And so yeah, it's we can win against anyone. So. Okay, so let me try and paraphrase that as to how I interpret it. For years, you have fought against it. You have given your all. You couldn't get there. There were so many disappointments. You come into this match where you are the absolute underdog. You have your teammates, and you just went for it. Is that? how I should say it basically like we like we had nothing to lose and they had everything to lose like rating MSI champions with themselves LPL champions the Asian Games champions River Alice champions <laughs> and there's just some European third seed team coming to get you <laughs> okay. yeah is there anything you can point to like game wise pick and ban wise uh, you know anything in the strategy of how you approach this last game by the way your LeBlanc was insane uh, of how you ended it I think that we just realized that, I mean, it was kind of obvious that they played towards bot, right? But we realized that, like, it was, like, kind of hard for our bot. And then we realized that we should, like, put more uh, strength on mid-jungle, mostly, because their top side is kind of weaker than their bot lane. So that's basically the approach, that's the games we won, and that's how we won the series, yeah. So I just wanted to play the Blanc because I saw Rookie play the Blanc, and he didn't buy items and stuff, and he was, like, a bit choking. So I had to, like, beat his Blanc performance. <laughs> I'm going to try one more time because I know it all feels surreal and, and you don't really know what to say, but perks, you know, having this kind of a performance in a game five when the whole world is watching and nobody is counting on you guys, you have a lot to be proud of. Can you kind of speak to that? Uh, I mean, it just didn't hit me yet, you know, it's just like nothing, nothing hit me yet, you know. Uh, I'm just really proud of my team, like they all play really well and like I've been feeling very stressed recently for the last like week or something in longer even. So sometimes I'm not like in the best mental shape. But uh, yeah, I'm just I'm I'm very grateful okay. for everything. Well, if you can do this, if you're not in the best mental shape, what can we expect now? Is everything now unleashed? I don't know, maybe I should just not be in best mental shape, and maybe that's when the like craziness comes out, you know? Because yeah, it's just I just have fun playing on stage. Mm -hmm. It seems like it hasn't hit you that much yet. Finally, what do you want to say about you know your teammates, all these guys who also came on stage here with you and played their hearts out? I don't know. I'm just yeah, I'm just really proud of all of them, and they're they're really really good, and we play really well together. And yeah, yeah, it's I don't know what else to say. Yeah, I I just can't believe it. You know, like our screams are sometimes not the most productive, and. Maybe we maybe just less limits and that's why we win, you know. So I, I yeah, I can't believe it. Yeah. <laughs> um, you wouldn't tell that you just knocked out the tournament favorites, RNG as the absolute underdogs. I think it's going to hit you in just a little bit. So we'll just take a breather. Thank you very much, Perks. Congratulations, absolute insanity here in Busan. Thank you so much, guys. Of course, I also had to grab Wadid and Yarn. And um, I just talked to Perks, and he just seemed to not realize what was happening. Do you guys realize what you just did? No, you can go. <laughs> yeah, for me, even though we win, uh, even though we won the series, like I feel really bad for my teammates because, like, I didn't perform well. You know, like I felt like I could lose every single game in this series because of me. So that's why like, I was like not that happy but still like we managed to finish as a team so i'm pretty happy with that yeah oh, Jaren, are you able to give some perspective on that yes it wasn't perfect yes some games were not good but at the end of the day it matters that you killed the last nexus as a team how do you feel about all this i mean i just the first two games i played i was it's my first time against Uzi as well and yeah. uh, the, they were playing like really like different from other bot laners and also with their picks, me and Madid was just like, all right, so what do we do now? Uh, we can't farm, so okay, what yeah. do we do? And then we were like... Yeah, it was really, really hard because yeah, it was like really they open. know how to use their jungler to play aggressive, and then they play aggressive every time their jungler is around, they know how to control vision as a bot lane, and they are good as mechanical as well. So it was really like, it was one of like toughest series like I ever played, but still like we know 
we kind of know that what is going on, you know, like, oh yeah, they're coming both sides again, guys. <laughs> so we try to play against it. We try to like go through it, you know. Um, yeah, pretty uh, much. From, from looking, uh, it was like everyone was nervous maybe backstage and at home. But whenever we looked at your cams, you guys were laughing and kind of shrugging everything off. Is it at the end of the day, the team mentality and, and atmosphere that helped you guys today? Mm, I mean, for sure the last game now, we, we knew that we was <laughs> won when my middle is like 8-0 yes. at minute 15. So like we were, we knew that game that we would win the last game. Yeah, yeah. So we were really confident. But then we tried to do Nasher and it was like, Okay, guys, and then, <laughs> then we get into like six items with Sievers. So we're like, okay, we have to try our guys. So, you know, like, it was really like yeah, yeah, serious yeah. after that. But we also had some yoking, yoking moments too. Yeah, yeah. we kind of tried to focus again, but like we were all hyped. Like everyone's like, oh, send me, send me, send me, send me. Send me. <laughs> no, no, you no, did you do it? no, no, I oh, didn't I do I didn't say anything. I didn't do anything. I but like everyone's like, everyone's joking. Like, I, I said, okay, guys, maybe we need to focus a bit. No, no, it's fine. Like we just can't <laughs> at the end of the game. It's like, okay, uh, Sievers is a bit strong. Guys. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> like, uh, I love it. You guys are still just joking around after what is the most important victory probably in your careers thus far. So maybe to wrap it up, what did you started playing here in Busan, in your hometown. You were so happy when you got those first wins in the group stage. But this must be almost unreal for you. Exactly. I was down on five, playing mid Talon, PC Bank tournament in this Busan. And right now I'm playing support and uh, I'm playing G2 Esports and I finally reached to same finals. I'm not sure is it true, like, yeah, is it real actually? <laughs> <laughs> it hurts, so it's true, guys. Sorry. Like, oh, yeah. We did it. Okay. I'm so happy with it. Okay. You did it. Uh, Jarnin, I just want to give you the last word because you've had to deal with a lot from everyone. Let me just put it that way. Mm -hmm. And even though not all games were perfect, you held your own versus Uzi and Ming and versus RNG. What would you like to say? I would say like to say thanks to all the fans that supported me throughout all the hard times and that will keep supporting us. Graceful in victory. Thank you guys so, so much. Amazing effort. Yarn and Wadid are going to the semifinals, guys. Back over to you. Lul. <laughs> <laughs>